guys, it's Amali and I'm at Distillery District today. Oh my gosh, Distillery District is one of my favorite, favorite places in Toronto. I love the vibe here because it's very like, I don't know, olden times? I don't know if that makes sense, but it kind of reminds me of like old Montreal. I'm loving the weather right now. I can't believe it's September and it feels like it's like mid-July. Today we're gonna try the classic $20 challenge. Now the distillery district does have a lot of boutique stores that are a little bit more expensive, so we're gonna see what we can get for $20. So one of the places that the distillery district is really well known for is their restaurant called El Catrin. And this is a Mexican restaurant that is really well known for its patio. If you ever come here during the summer, the patio is always popping. Since it's such a nice day outside, I wanna head over to the patio and grab a drink and hopefully it's in my budget. I don't know what to drink. Sangria? Oh, I feel like you can't go wrong with the sangria. Ah, is that a beef? Only thing I hate about summer is bugs. Guys, I feel like I'm gonna boil to death here. Oh my gosh, I'm sitting like directly in the sun. I can't even look into the camera properly. I'm like squinting. Looks so yummy, cheers! Oh my god, this is actually really good. Oh my gosh, I look like a little golden Oscar. Um. <laughs> So I got the white sangria and this might blow my budget because like with tax and tip and everything it's probably going to come up to like 15 bucks but so worth it because the sangria is so good. Whenever me and my friends go out during the summer and we hit up some patios we always get a pitcher of sangria and I just haven't been able to do that this summer so I'm really happy that I'm getting to enjoy the last bits of summer and enjoy sipping on a really really good sangria. So guys, the drink was $13.50, tax, tips, everything included. So I have about $6.50 left to spend. Let's see what we can go find. One of my favorite things about the distillery district is the love sign. Now this is the cutest sign ever. It has a bunch of locks on it. And so you can buy a lock, write your name on it, and then hook it to this sign. So I'm gonna show you guys what that looks like. Isn't that crazy? It's the cutest thing and there's so many locks on it. I just saw a popsicle stand. I love popsicles. I'm gonna go grab a popsicle to cool me off on this nice hot day. Guys, there's so many different flavors to choose from. I don't know which one I want. So this is $3, so I have another $3.50 left to spend. I think I'm gonna go with strawberry because you can't go wrong with strawberry. So yummy, let's, I can't even get it out. Good stuff. The struggle. Can, oh, okay. Tips and tricks, guys. Got it. Got it. Kind of. Oh my god. Okay, there we go. Got it. So yummy. I think I'm a type of person that bites into popsicles. Is that weird? So I'm just enjoying my popsicle and I'm gonna explore the rest of the distillery district. I'm gonna try and find the big heart that everyone takes pictures with. I love how everyone is sitting on a patio right now in the middle of September. Like, this is ridiculous. I've been in here before. They do the Chinese zodiacs. I'm a, I'm a chicken, I think. A rooster, that's what it is. Not a chicken, a rooster. These paper cranes are so cool. They look so pretty. So we're still on the hunt for that heart. And I think I see it in the distance over there. So I'm gonna go take a cute selfie over there. I have $3.50 left to spend and I spotted a chocolate place just around the corner. And obviously you guys know I have the biggest sweet tooth, so I'm gonna go see if I can grab a little chocolate to eat. I'm at Laura Slack's truffle store called Mesonet, and they have some amazing truffles here that I need to try. There's one that's like a hand-painted skull, and it just looks so dope, so that's what I'm gonna get. 
guys, look how cute this is. I don't even want to eat it. It looks so good. I just, I don't want to ruin it. I'm going to eat the back so the front, front doesn't get ruined. So yummy. There's like caramel inside of it. All right guys, I'm done here at the distillery district. I kept within my budget. I got a sangria, a popsicle, and a truffle. And I have a little bit less than a dollar to spend. So I did really good here. I did eat a lot of sugar though. So I feel like I'm gonna have a sugar rush really soon.